Every time someone tried to catch him, he would run away. Oh, get it, get it, get it, get it. Oh. I saw a post about him on Facebook. Miles had been astray for an entire year. The next morning, I jumped to my car, I drove up, and I was like, I'm gonna get this done. I'm gonna save him. Oh, there he is. There he is. There's other stray dogs that would attack him, and it gets to like 110 degrees sometimes. Hi, baby. I'm here for you. You ready to get out of here? Okay. I can't even imagine him trying to find shade, trying to find shelter. We're gonna get you out of here. We're gonna get you home. It's okay. Come here. It's okay, baby. Cookie. Cookie. There you go. He's accepting treats for me. And then I'm just gonna put this on you, okay? See? It's nothing. And then he's like, oh, no, 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 no. I don't know what your plan is with that, but I'm not even going near you with that. You want more cookies? At that point, he started to run away from me. Well, I lost the dog. He was too scared. I would find him laying in front of another house. I found you. You put me on a little hunt. So I'd find him laying in a construction site. I'm running out of cookies. Okay, good boy. Good boy. Yeah. I just did that for about six, seven hours. It was just trying to get him and I couldn't. I was heartbroken because it was dark. I had to find help. I had to find a trapper. Within a week, I found Danny. Megan and I had come up with a time that we were gonna get him safe. I happened to get there just a, a little bit before Megan did. Off in the distance, I see this big white dog. Hi there, hi there, big boy. I saw a fence and a gate it turned out to be a dog park. I had no idea. Lured him into the dog park with hot dogs. I was able to slowly close that gate. So I'm gonna to try to just keep him in here, let her sneak up. It was a big sigh of relief when Megan and Courtney pulled up. Courtney is a friend that I knew from my hometown. He was very adamant that he will capture Miles. Hey. Do it. Do it. Do it. Oh my god, he almost had it. Yay, 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 yay! yay! I could cry. I literally am crying. He said he would do it. He said, do it. He said he could do it. Come on. When he had the leash on, he was paralyzed. Now it's just like getting him to walk. As you can see, he's so scared. Or like if we got to carry him in. Good boy. Leaving was such a relief. He just is looking back to like where he was for an entire year of fending for himself. Miles went straight to a doggy daycare. Mm, the pet was one. Okay, just fine. He was just able to completely decompress. And then he moved over to his foster's house. He's become a dog. He's jumping on his foster's lap. He's interacting with other dogs. He walks on his leash. He has a bed to sleep in. He smiles, he knows he's safe. People wonder why I do this every single day. It's for this.